BetOnline.com with our third place finisher, Brandon Chessman. Brandon, you had to fight for that one. Grant was all over you on that last lap. I saw you looking behind you on that triple over there. How are you feeling tonight? Uh, you know, I was feeling pretty good. I had to come out of the last chance qualifier, but uh, my Monster Energy Pro Circuit Kawasaki got me out to a great start. And, uh, you know, I just worked my way through the pack. And, yeah, I saw Josh over that triple to the last lap. And uh, I just tried to uh, not make any mistakes and, you know, work through the lappers the best I could, and it paid off. So where have you been at this season? Because you're kind of one of those guys that I figured would kind of be a front runner, be up there all the time. We haven't seen you very much up in the front. What's been going on with your season? How you been feeling? I've been feeling pretty good. Doing, doing good lap times and practice and everything. Just haven't put the main events together. I haven't gotten a decent start and stayed up. You know, I just had little problems with wrecking the first couple of laps. We're getting a really bad start, so uh, you know, I capitalized on that and uh, you know, worked out pretty good tonight. All right, well, good luck in St. Louis. Thanks. Hey, thank you. Rainy Jessamine, our third place finisher here in Detroit. Devin Mitchell here, Supercross on. Why not go? I'm so pumped I did not get squirted with that. Thank you for not getting it. Jamie, we appreciate your hard work. Today. All right. Are we still rolling? Okay, we're still rolling. We're here with our second place finisher who just got doused with a whole bunch of champagne by his team manager. Um, how are you feeling tonight? It's got to be exciting. You're not, you haven't had the best of seasons. We haven't seen you up front. You've had a lot of bad luck. What's going on with you right now? Oh, I'm so happy. I've been, <coughs> I've been working so hard. And I just kind of came unprepared this year. I came in with an injury and just been, you know, fighting through it. And it's glad to finally be up there and be where I belong. So what's the deal for uh, St. Louis? Now that you have this momentum, I heard from your team that they're waiting for you to kind of get that fire underneath you and get going again. Is this going to be something we're going to see you up here more? I sure hope so. I'm going to try my hardest. All right. Ryan Morris, our now soaked second place manager here in Detroit. You didn't really have to fight hard for that one. You, you won your heat. You went out. You got the whole shot. You took home. You know what? You're going to win St. Louis most likely. You're going to get out there. You're going to take the championship there. How are you feeling tonight? Um, it, uh, it feels great. You know, finally, it's uh, it's finally, uh, you know, the points are really close. It was 17 coming tonight, and now it's down to three. And, and it's I think I'm in a pretty good position uh, going into next weekend. So uh, do you feel any extra pressure on you now that Trey, you know, Trey had those problems at, in this moto, kind of put you up front now. You're going in St. Louis. That, you know, you can take it home, you can wrap it up. Is there is there a lot of like a like a burden on your back now, or are you just gonna go for it? Definitely, there's uh, there's always pressure, but uh, I think it's uh, the ball's in my court right now. Especially I've I've done this before, and this will this is gonna be my last uh, <clears throat> um, last time riding um, you know lights in in uh, in Supercross next year. You guys will see me on a 450. So uh, definitely like to leave uh, with a East Coast Championship. So are you guys testing right now, getting ready for the outdoor season as well? Are you getting ready for the 250F uh, lights class there? Are you going to switch to 450s? What are you guys going to do? No, yeah, we're uh, definitely riding some outdoor and uh, going to do, do the 250F class and, and uh, you know, try to make it three in a row for a championship outdoors. Right on. Good luck. Congratulations tonight. Ryan Villapoto, our first place manager here in Detroit.